so here is my setup for today uh, as you can see it is totally isolated from any computer it is powered by an external battery here through this and just connect this 5 volts and ground to the Arduino let me show you the connections for the Arduino for this so it is uh, almost the same circuit as before uh, these are the four connections going to the servos like before additional connections are these to the HC12 module so I just bring HC12 module here and then the set is going to the 5 volts RX and TX are connected here and uh, the power supply goes to the power supply so that is how we are powering the HC12 and I just added a uh, capacitor for HC12 and it is uh, totally powered with a battery a normal cell phone power bank and uh, it is programmed to read data from HC12 and on the computer right there let me go to the computer on a computer here I've connected my HC12 module through USB DDL connection so this is my HC12 and let me go to the computer screen so as I send any commands from here like this for example it, it, it is received on the you can you can hear the sound let me do it again so as I send commands from here Okay, let me show you the view from here. Okay, so I'm pressing the command. Okay, so uh, there is slight problem with this actually. You can see the other motors vibrating as well when I just change the one. So as I give just same command repeatedly, I see all the motors vibrating for some reason which I cannot figure out. Okay, so that's it.